Ah, zoom. It's time for an update. Wait, what was that zoom sound effect? Let me hear it again. Zoom. Are you actually kidding me? Can we get a pro, please? Ah. <laughs> Definitely use that. I will, and I did. All right, rewind, and let's get playback. Ah. It's time for an update. It's been a big few weeks, but I've been fortunate enough to share it with some truly wonderful humans and non-humans. This is Brooke from the Positive Pet Project and her delightful dog, Albert. We've also had a cat, an owl, two puffins and a turkey getting up to all sorts of mischief. There Once Was a Puffin is a new and bold creation from the team at Little Match Productions. There's a link below if you would like to learn more about what we've been doing to deliver theatre in a digital space. Both of these projects were kicked off with an idea and a quick 15 minute screen test to check the vibe. Don't hesitate to get in touch if you've got an idea but you're not sure if it'll work. I'm always happy to help work through some scenarios in the space. Which leads us to... My tip for this update is if you are looking for a small, well-priced, easy-to-use, compact point-and-shoot camera to create some content with that's a step up from a phone and a step down from a professional camera. Sony have recently released the ZV-1. I bought one with my own money and I have no affiliation with Sony, but after playing with this thing for a few days, my sense is that they have managed to create a well-balanced camera that will meet most people's needs for simple content creation. The battery drains quickly and the internal mic doesn't sound appealing to my ears, but the image quality and the autofocus are quite remarkable for such a tiny, tiny camera. I tell you to go check out my vlog, but honestly, apart from this bit where Melissa and I do tiny squats over the sun, not even I can handle how boring it was. Getting back to bigger cameras, it's been an absolute treat to work with local producer slash camera operator Dan Schist. He's got a wealth of experience in television and freelance camera operating and it's been really exciting to have teamed up with him on some projects over the past few weeks. Between us, we're really well placed to capture live musical performances with our multi-camera setup, whether that's a live gig, live studio recording or miming playback for a music film clip. So don't hesitate to get in touch if you're chasing some content as the 2020 calendar is filling up fast. It's like one of these scenes. One of these beautiful afternoon scenes, golden light. 